Good morning to you and my friends, I'm Dale Fix and it's it's 5 a.m. in the morning for me. Um unfortunately it's gonna be a busy, busy day for me. So I decided to go up early. And this will enable us to uh, have a bit of fun. Have a bit of fun. It's been a it's been a while since I actually played because you know it's uh, well I kinda have a lot of videos already. <laughs> <laughs> I want to continue so badly. So here we are. Um, probably for three hours. So what have we been doing? So we had a rough start. We had a rough start playing as the driven simulators. Staying in, in this pathway. Then a war broke out between this federation and this guy. And we had an opportunity to go in and annihilate. Yes. And we did so. We uh, we definitely did. So we we're, we're breaking apart an alliance, and that is of course what we want to be doing. So by the looks of it, we're making a hundred and ninety alloys, which is extremely extremely nice. I truly enjoy that. Where would you upgrade if I told you to do so? You would upgrade right here. I. I'm pretty much forward for that. Let's do that. You, on the other hand, we will allow you to take these systems. Then we'll allow you to heal up over at this station. We are currently building up a fleet by the looks of it. One fleet is over here. The other one is standing over here. We are also building up a bunch. Bunch more. Let's get ourselves a, another general going. I kind of like the um, the morale damage. So let's take the unit W9. <clears throat> well, I'll uh, take a sip for my coffee because it is still 5 a.m. for me. So, let's see, what we have debris, we do want to work with that, and where is my scientist? So, oh damn you, oh they locked me in, you bastard. Let's see, you're inferior, I could declare war, and then go back, take this station, and it would be relatively safe. Um, but do I need another war right now? We, we could easily do this war with this one fleet. Um, but yeah, we'll have to get this fleet once it's upgraded to go in here and just just destroy this this fella. It needs to happen. It needs to happen because he is keeping my fleets apart. And right now, I would not have a um, have an area where I don't think I can jump. Right? No, I can't. Oh, that is so annoying. Yeah, okay, well, that, that just said, uh, this guy, uh, he made a very, very bad decision on his own behalf. If we would open borders, he, he, he's semi-friendly. I, I, I don't care about opening borders. We would also declare war on this fellow, who is equivalent in fleet. So, that's more than 50k. Now, it's not more than 50k, it's around 50k. My construction ship, do you have something to do? No. I don't think this guy will attack me anytime soon. Especially once we get all of this. So I'm also starting to have the AI run some planets. And we'll see how that will go. I'll keep these two as... Especially him as a research focus. Uh, but for now the planets aren't too difficult to manage. And we'll have to see what the AI will do. So let us on pause. Let's make sure that you are going to be upgrading. Hopefully it's going to be a wonderful upgrade. Uh, what kind of wares do you got? Oh, robot upkeep. No deal mate. I've already had that. Not interested. Move along. Move the hell along i don't need you mm, again i'm going to destroy you if you keep this up and i think that they are yeah they're over here we might have to kill them 
<laughs> because they are so annoying. And it should not be too big of a deal. I should. I should actually attack them for RP's sake. Let's close this off. Uh, we're saving up on alloys. I would like to see the um, the mega engineering. Oh, look at that. That is sweet. That is really nice. Okay, we're attacking that one. Well, then we're going here. And... Yeah, that fleet is going to be uh, in for a ride. <laughs> That's some horrible timing. Let's take a look. Research output. I'm on top of my influence. I don't like that. Hmm. I should actually go for the gateway travel. Is there anything that we can do? So we have three edicts and we're right inside of our empire sprawl. Is there something that we would like? I, I need options. I need way more options to deal with my influence. I think we'll be capped out a lot. What am I consuming? Okay, envoy. Who am I envoying at the moment? Why? You know, let's send the envoy over here. You know, just for the fun. Uh, I don't know why I'm having an envoy in this guy's territory. Because I'm about to uh, wipe the floor with him. So many stations. And we still need to upgrade quite a bit of them. Uh, we do want to upgrade this station. And also make sure that it has better defensive means. Targeting computer... I like the supply speed. I think I have them on all of them. Yeah, I do. A disruption field generator. So that's going to be a new one. We'll use our credits. And I also like to upgrade this one. It's already been queued. Not really liking that. This makes no sense. And we'll, we'll have a tiny bit of a peace deal going on. Now we don't need to upgrade all of the other stations at the time because our naval cap is just nowhere near what we can do at some pause let's continue i wonder i wonder look at this 24.9 and i think it's going to be extremely high i'm hoping around i'm always hoping around 30 i don't know why but i'm always hoping that 30 is going to be the magical number Oh yeah, that fleet is not going to like this. Oh, we got better armor already. And here we go, the Mega Engineering. Oh yeah, I will definitely, definitely take this before the Titan. Oh, that's just sweet. Yeah, now I definitely need to save up on my alloys. So, 43 days. I'm hoping he will jump in before he's able to jump out. Okay, you need to upgrade one more time. Wow, that is extremely... Why can we reinforce you? That makes no sense. This fleet is completely full. Let's upgrade you again. Hopefully this will update. Yeah, we can still get more in here. What am I missing? He was able to jump out, which is annoying. How many can I add? Like 10? Oh yeah, I, I'll do that. It's at uh, 10 over here as well. So we definitely are going over our naval capacity. Okay, I need you to go here. I really actually need you to attack the station. Otherwise, he's going to get away. And I don't like that. Alert. Spaceport engaged. Yeah, I know. I know. Diplomatic alert. Military confrontation detected. Ah, we don't care about that war. 
I wonder what this will do because we'll, we'll get a lot of cool as uh, new armors. I like that. All of these are working, which is good. We still have four armies to build. It's going to be a nice looking army. So what will you do? What will you do? Oh yeah, you're you yeah, come back. That's what I need. Dude, seriously, attack this. Go aggressive. Go aggressive. It's going on in the background. There we go. I have more damage. Hey! Man, you're up early. I'm doing good. How about you? Fleet command limit? No, we're still building up star base capacity. You know, it's always nice. Reverse engineering just gives me, I think, energy. We don't generally care about that. I don't care about it. I cannot sleep. How? That. Sorry to hear. Sorry to hear that. Let's take a look here. So we kind of need enmities. Let's build up a city district. Available jobs negative seven. Because we're assimilating them. Hostile fleet assets engaged. That's the pause there for a second um research itself goes wide i would like to change this completely i will sacrifice these to get you we got eight more jobs let's replace you with more research and because this is just enmity jobs A robot civilization, yeah, man, we're driven as simulators. We don't need influence to to do wars. Let's see, where do I want to start build? I thought it was over here, the Forge Planet. So let us replace you with alloy, and I'll replace you with more alloys. Do we have that special building to increase? the amount of alloys that we push out i don't see it yet so i guess we're not having it no we're not having it yet let's build two more so we'll at least fulfill those jobs in the future while making a sick amount of alloys yeah, we're, uh, we can wreak havoc to the galaxy. And I don't like that. This is another Forge world. I kind of don't need, like, all of the research on it. But we'll build up on the minerals. They're doing still something. That is nice. I could give them more minerals, but it, it doesn't really... We don't need it. So let's go back, take this system, and then we'll uh, we'll heal up. Yeah, we'll, we'll we'll take it before we heal up. I don't think they will attack me at, at all right now. They're not in the position. We're still upgrading this fleet. I'm still hoping for 30k. So everyone will be assimilated. It's it's peace to the galaxy. Peace to the galaxy. Hopefully. Well, that's peace for us, not, not necessarily for them. So let's go up and let's uh, let's heal. What kind of star base are you? So you're a man. You're all bastions. Not liking that at all. We should upgrade this star fortress as well. Yeah, we need to upgrade all of our star fortresses. So, let's see, are we capping out on stuff? Well, luckily we're not, since we have a crazy amount of storage, by the looks of things. Is the, uh, is the box still in here? Let's take a look. Yeah, it is. Damn you. Come on, Paradox, get this damn bug out. <laughs> I really hate that. I really hate that bug. So, is there a way for us to get in here? 
Yeah, we, we do need to go to war. And I will be sending in this fleet once it's ready. Oh, seriously, you're attacking me now. Oh, I like that. that that's smart. I, I That's big brain time for you guys. There you go. I'll uh, transfer this guy into a shipyard temporarily. And we'll get battle stations on there as well. So we can upgrade you while at war. Not costing us anything. What well, bug? Well, okay. So there is this bug. For those of you who don't know. <clears throat> where you can sell your energy for energy. And then we'll be able to buy more. Look at this. Because it's six free. So you just go sell, sell, and uh, buy, sell, buy, sell, buy, and you'll just fill up your energy thing. It's actually one of those things, again, that Wenek was able to find, which is bloody annoying. Because I'm really, really disappointed about that bug. So we're waiting for this to happen. We don't need to rush that. We'll probably finish this war before we do this. Since, well, he's already at 100% and well, we can always peace out if we really need to. Let's see, so those are ready, you are healing, you are ready. That's what I wanted to see, go there. Um, we'll have the army stand, stand by, we'll wipe these guys out. Uh, we got some curators here. Well met, greeting star travels, we're the curators. you ugly as curators. Can you aid us in our research? Let's see, we'll get... Oh yeah, plus 10%. <laughs> Wise choice. Whoa. Yeah, it is a... Um, no, yeah, it is. It is a... It's an exploit that is actually right now keeping us from doing a multiplayer session because we know that it will be abused. So where's the curators? Let's take a look. Contacts. Curators. Let's tell us about the mysteries. Tell us about the enigmatic fortress. Can a fortress be entered? Yeah, we, we have the enigmatic fortress over here. I will have to see. Uh, I'm a... Uh, uh, yeah, I noticed that. That's so cool. I really, um, really like Distant Worlds. Let's see. Come on, guys. Go there. And we'll do declare war. How how horrible is the station? Oh, it's, it's nothing. It is nothing. This, these bastions are nothing. Actually, they're not bastions. So, with you over here, are you ready? No, 45 days. So how is that series going, mate? Did you start the series yet, or...? Let's uh, go to speed free. For a bit. Diplomatic alert. There we go, so there's a war deck I don't care about. Yeah, man, you are going to die. Diplomatic <sighs> alert. War protocols initiated. Come on. Let's go. Open up the bloody borders for me. Just one is enough to start the upgrade process. I'm thinking. Yeah, man, it's, it's cool. I like that. Oh, not that you're thinking, but um, the distant worlds thing. I just uh, return... Or remember how it was. Yeah, I can imagine. You've been out of it for a, uh, for a while there. So let's upgrade that fleet. And we'll start moving in with this fleet. Because he is just blocking my uh, my way to these guys. And we're now at war with... <laughs> just a good portion of the galaxy. Which we, of course, don't care about at all. We've got some strong ships. I uh, truly like. This fleet can be monstrous. So we're going to be saving up on alloys. Uh, I say that now, I say that now. We should be, because we actually got Mega Engineering. Look at that, Mega Structure Restoration. You know what that means, right? That means that we have a Ring World Start, so we can actually return these to uh, to their former glory. 
It takes about 10 years and 10,000 alloys. So we desperately want to save up on that. Let's go send the armies over there. Okay, cool. So, is the uh, the retention good on the uh, on the series? Are you getting uh, good views? Technological acquisition successful. Let's go. Let's see. New research, and I would like to go for. Yeah, we don't care about habitability. Let's go with battle frames. We should actually name a leader. Mm, let's do our general. I don't think we have you in the series, right? So let's go. Vendalf. 89. There we go. So if you're watching this in the future, guys, on the, on the, on the YouTube, then uh, if you want to be in the series, just uh, pop on over on Twitch and be there when I start streaming. So we'll take this war somewhat slow. Because I do like to get this uh, this thing going. Hey, thing, yeah, no problem, man. You you're here, so uh, I might as well just uh, give you your own character to command. So he's over there. I want you to go here, move there. We've got two construction ships by the looks of it. Let's um, get rid of this one. And I kind of want to start building one more. Let's do another science ship. Uh, for him to go with this this army over here. Technological acquisition successful. Elgate travel. Serving speed plus 33%, which is useless at this point of the game. We'll, uh, we'll take out some of these small technologies. No, just stay over here. So there's this uh, this fleet going on over there. And he won't attack. This station is going to be stronger. That's why I'm waiting here. I'm actually waiting for him to go back. We did lose a destroyer. Which is highly unfortunate. And there's their fleet. 6, 12. Oh, it's still a good sized fleet. Yeah, man. Look at that. 13, 19. And it's 27. Oh, wow. This fleet is going to be struggling. Will he send them all in at once? Now that is the question. And where are you going right now? So you're moving out. I love it when you do that. Because when I take your planets, <laughs> it's over. I, I can easily just take this. Just take it for myself. And we'll fill in the rest. Yeah, once this upgradation is done. We should definitely push onwards with this. Shipyard's going to be built. That makes a bit. That makes all of it a bit faster. You're going into this direction. Look at this bastion. That's a bastion. His fleet. They. They. He can't do anything. I like that. Let's go towards the next station. I'm not too worried about these guys since they do. They have open borders with them. I don't think so. Technological acquisition successful. Uh, was last time on G. Oh, cool. I've, uh, I've, I've, yeah, Did you, you weren't able to sleep then with GK, but GK is, is usually streaming like an hour before this. Building cost negative five. Wimble travel particle lands. I would like to go and take out some of these small attacks because they're just annoying. Let him be upgraded. And we'll just continue through. So what will you do, mate? Yeah, he's just undecisive. Now, if he sends in... Look at that. He's just going from left to right, left to right. Are you are you actually jumping out this time? Technological acquisition successful. Battle frames? Uplift? Nobody cares about that. Let's take the reverse engineering. Look at that. He's just, he just doesn't know what to do. Not that I mind. Uh, but still, there we go. We got one planet. And um, we'll just take things slow again. You. Go there and be aggressive. Oh, there is movement now. 
Yeah, he's just sending the fleets left and right. So if this happens, uh, this fleet will be losing a lot of ships before he gets reinforced by it. Uh, what kind of weapons am I using? So, let's just go to fleet management. So, we got ourselves a missile boat for some high damage. And also to do a, a lot, a lot of uh, additional hull damage. We have our point of defense. That's why we're, we're losing them so badly. I'm still lacking a good combat computer. Maybe I should go on line or artillery i'm not sure yet uh the cruisers they are carriers and we have our battleships that just bombard the living crap out of everything spiral mount this will just annihilate annihilate others so we should actually start designing a new battleship I would like to go with an X slot. Let's go large and even large again. And not Nutrien. Can we go with a additional weapon? Let's take a look here. Well, what I'm lacking is... Where's my artillery? Or we just go with a massive carrier with some M slots and this will be our uh, replacement for the cruiser yeah a lot of point defense this will actually render the destroyer completely obsolete let's pull this one off again I like the chance to fire and you, you're, you're a line ship. No, actually, you're a carrier. Laser, missiles, or kinetic. I'll uh, look at, the, at that right a second. Uh, let's uh, change the name. The Redeemer. No. The Silencer. The Retaliator. That's a cool name. I like that. Now, I don't need weapons that are too close range. I, w I do need, like, smaller weapons for when fleets are getting too close. The Retaliator is just going to be the replacement of my cruiser and my destroyer. Probably the Corvette is going to be around the longest because they're just cheap. They're just cheap. Oh, I was going to take a look at uh, what kind of uh, missiles. They are energy. They're energy. So yeah. Technological acquisition success. What do we got? Yeah, you know, useless tech. We'll just um, take out more some of these. Oh, that's cool. That is cool. So the station is back. Let's heal up for a second here. Let's take a look if their fleets are still idiots. Yeah, they're still going left and right. How is this upgrade coming along? I think it's relatively far. So we're going to be saving up, um, hopefully, till 10k. Some of the stations are upgrading. I'm, sa I'm saying that. I'm saying we need are saving up. This bastion will remove at some point because we've got bastion over here. And this is another bastion. They really like their bastions. So my armies are on route. Uh, we should actually go in here. Just an additional 4.2k. That's quite nice. Let's go here. And we'll take care of the smaller systems later. Yeah, you shouldn't have closed your borders, dude. That just got yourself killed. You got yourself killed. We could also just focus on this guy for a second. And then go back towards the rest of them. I think we should do that. Once the upgrade is done, we'll do that. I, I really enjoy carriers. Peace offer. Status quo. Nobody, nobody cares about your status quo, dude. The enemy of my enemy. Granting counter attack causes belly. You know, that's just more, more reasons to fight. I like that. So we're now at 5-1. 
Which means that we're in the upper tier of the galaxy. I like that. So plasma accelerators. Let's go for the plasma cannons. And what else do we got? We got the reversed engineering. 